let's learn how a student can create a 30 second video with Animoto. So I am uh, acting as a student. I've created an account for my son Ethan and uh, so I might be Ethan in class and I come to Animoto and it's really easy to start. I pick one of these templates here that's going to be my background and uh, you know let's say I like this one so I grab this. Animoto tells me I can get longer videos if I want to purchase it but you know all I have to do is go to here make a 30 second video for free pretty easy to do so what's gonna happen is Animoto is going to give me this very simple uh, how to make your video palette so I can change the style I can get music I can get pictures so let's say that we use this to introduce ourselves I like that as an activity with Animoto so I might come into pictures and you see it gives you lots of options and uh, you know but I'm gonna upload uh, a picture from my computer. So, you know, I'm Ethan and I come in and I, I find some pictures, maybe some vacation pictures. And, uh, you know, I don't know, I just find this one here that I want to add. And you see uh, right away, Animoto is adding that picture to my mix. So, that picture will come up. And then the next thing I might want to do is maybe add some text. So I'm going to come in and I'm going to click into add text. And you see I have get a header with 22 characters and a text with 30 characters. So you're not going to write a lot there. I'm Ethan. Uh, maybe something about Ethan. I love football. And I save that. And now that pops up. And now I'm into my next tile, which will then go into my video. And maybe I want to add some more pictures or graphics. And uh, let's say I go to the image library that Animoto provides. And I come into uh, animals, might be cool. And I find something, uh, you know, I, I like this, uh, uh, this really cool beast here. So I double click on him. Uh, shows up mountain lion that's very nice I'm gonna add that item to my mix and maybe now I'm gonna add some more text so I'm gonna, I'm gonna save that and um, anyways you know that's the idea there so I can continue um, and I'm, I'm gonna go ahead it's telling me up here you know how much time I have uh, so I could add more to get up to my time limit. I'm going to put some music in. You know, you've got topics. I'm going to go to popular songs. You don't get a ton in your free version, uh, but you know, there's a few things here, so you know, I might just go with this. I can hear it. I'll add the song. And uh, you know, Animoto will do that. So anyways, I'm, I'm ready to go here. I could add more if I want to. Uh, I can preview my video and it's generating that preview I could just skip and produce let's say I, you know I'm happy with what I've done and I think this is going to be pretty good so I'm going to produce that and you see it's doing it uh, Animoto is creating a video and you'll see this won't take very long and so here's my produced video and you know I can go ahead and play that right here in my Animoto So, you know, that's a real quick video. It could be longer, which is great. Now, I can share that. I can click on the sharing. Uh, I can get a link to send out. An embed code's great, you know, if, I, if my students have a blog or a classroom website, as mine do, they can just get this and they can put it on their site, which is really nice. They can come up and share it on an interactive whiteboard. So, this is a really nice way to have students uh, share content in a project. I like to have them introduce themselves with this. What a fun way to start the year. And that is Animoto from a student's point of view in five minutes or less.